Hi all! In this release, we will check out an innovative platform for transportation of bulky goods, an unusual machine for purifying water reservoirs, and a few more interesting vehicles. Let's get started! KUKA OMNIMOVE Transportation of cargo within loading gauge and heavy loads is the main task of the mobile platform KUKA OMNIMOVE. Its main feature is the possibility of both manual and automatic control. Even with its considerable size and high load, the platform can move without issues in the offline mode without danger of collision with anyone or anything. It can also be equipped with an auxiliary power supply, which operates independently of the main one. A professional approach to the development of the platform enabled creating a specialized wheel operation system allowing KUKA OmniMove to move in any direction. In addition, the three-dimensional shape of the wheels, along with the stabilization system, allows them to work independently from each other. Thanks to a sophisticated navigation system, the platform is able to move around indoors without a risk of encountering an obstacle. The platform is capable of transporting loads with a length of up to 99 feet and weighing up to 90 tons, with the accuracy of their movement being up to 0.2 inches. Also, the platform can be equipped with many different options depending on the customer's preferences. Lake Cleaning Machine is a machine for collecting algae, floating debris, and dirt from the surface of large outdoor and indoor reservoirs. The vehicle is driven by lobed wheels, similar to those of steamships. The machine scoops the debris from the surface with a large, unusual bucket, which also serves as a conveyor belt. Then the trash is fed into the body. The lake cleaning machine can only collect debris, but does not recycle and does not compress it. So it can be cleared from the hulk using the same conveyor for spreading the contents ashore or pouring them into the loader. This technology can also purify reservoirs from plants with long roots and shallow growing algae. However, the machine is not designed to clean the sea bottom or shores. It perfectly copes with plastic and duckweed. Water coming from the garbage itself leaves through the conveyor belt. The machine is about 33 feet long, 118 inches wide, and 197 inches in height from the water line. Tracked Land Rover is a wheeled caterpillar all-terrain vehicle designed on the basis of the 1958 Land Rover. It was redesigned for driving in the ultimate off-road conditions, beaches, snow, sand, rocks, and other types of loose, inconvenient soil. Triangle steel chains replaced each wheel. Its main advantage from other ATVs is that it's good for driving in the city without damaging the asphalt. However, do not expect high speeds, as it's capable of a maximum of 20 miles per hour. In total, 15 prototypes have been manufactured at this time. One was recently put up for auction with an estimated value of $65,000 to $78,000. Wirtgen WR250 is a machine designed to fortify the soil during the construction of roads and to process old, soft pavement. Its operation is based on a rotating aerating roller with numerous spikes, which can loosen the soil up to 20 inches deep from the surface level. The depth is easily adjustable from the operator's cabin. Fortifying of the soil is ensured by water supply, bitumen, concrete, or any other technical mixtures on the surface of loosened soil. The machine has hoses for connecting to tanks with liquid, a tanker truck. Its distinctive feature is the 4x4, which reduces the radius of a full turn to only 118 inches. It can also be used on slopes by means of automatic adjusting the level of the wheels, raising or lowering the axis of each of them. When driving on uneven soil, the wheels adjust in height, allowing the machine to always maintain a flat, horizontal position. Vityaz DT30 Vityaz DT30 is designed for joint operation in difficult terrain and in harsh climate conditions. Its uniqueness allows you to overcome those areas where other transport will be of little use, in fords, off-road, mud, and rocky surfaces. In addition, this model of the all-terrain vehicle can withstand temperature changes from 104 to negative 58 degrees Fahrenheit. It should be noted that the DT30 is a two-piece Caterpillar all-terrain vehicle, which allows you to not only traverse hard-to-reach terrain, but it also acts as a powerful tractor and a high-speed vehicle. 
It also has excellent mobility and maneuverability. The main designation of the DT-30 is the transportation of goods and weapons to destinations along difficult-to-reach roads. There are several modifications of this machine. Depending on the nature of the tasks performed, conducting works on a variety of terrains, transporting goods, etc. BLG-60 The armored bridge layer BLG-60 was developed by engineers from eastern Germany and Poland. At the moment, it is in service in several countries around the world. For example, to date the Swedish Army hasn't got any bridge lane machines in operation. Its length in the unfolded mode is 70.9 feet, width is 126 inches and height is 31.5 inches. Such dimensions allow covering 65.6 feet of road gaps with a carrying capacity of 50 tons. The surface of BLG-60 is covered with plastic coating and has embossed patterns. Along the edges of the bridge, the engineering car has closed beams. All the wheels are solid, allowing the vehicle to bypass the characteristics of its competitor from the Czech Republic, bridge layer MT-55A. This bridge layer is equipped with a collective protection system and can be controlled underwater. Guys, thanks for watching. If this video was interesting, please support me with your likes, comments, or reposts on your social media platforms. This will be of great help for the channel. Don't miss the next video. See you then.